Satoshi, hold this. You sure? Yeah, that's why he's here. Sure, no problem. I was out with my friends, two boys and three girls. We were at the fireworks festival. Here we are. I got here at 4 a.m. to get this spot. Amazing! After the fireworks, I drank myself stupid. Soon, everything I drank came right back out. Everyone seemed really happy. Huh, this is great! This is just how my body worked, but my parents didn't think so. They did all kinds of tests on me. They still take me to the doctors. Moroboshi, Tsukishiro, thank you for this. All those girls in front of me, that was amazing. You guys are the only people who understand me. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Just clean up after yourself before you go home, okay? All right. I was so happy. On my way home, I was still kind of drunk. Then I heard someone's voice. Help! Help me! Some pretty girl was stuck in the tree. I didn't know it at the time, but running into her completely changed my life. What's going on? My clothes, they got stuck on one of the branches. Can you help me? She had beautiful long hair. Her white kimono was stuck in the branch. I tried pulling her and I tried pushing her, but I couldn't unhook her. What happened? I was working on my jumps. Then I got stuck. I tried pulling on her clothes again. It won't move. I tried pulling harder, but nothing. Then I started feeling all funny inside. I got this kimono for my grandma. I don't want to rip it. She was looking up at me. Her eyes were magical. She was adorable. Don't worry, you got this, Satoshi. Thank you, Satoshi. <sighs> she threw herself at me. I looked up and there she was, right in front of me. Sorry! Oh no, it's fine. By the way, what are you wearing underneath? Uh, my underwear? I liked girls, but they usually stayed away from me due to my condition. I've never been close to a girl before. I'm losing my mind. Take off her clothes and look inside. I heard a voice inside me. She can't move, right? Just feel her up a little. Shut up, you! Don't do it! This is wrong! You'll regret it for the rest of your life! You don't want to lose your virginity? Shut up! My mind was racing. I can hear everything. <laughs> those eyes, those lips, those ankles. The devil took over. Hey! I'm sorry! What the? <laughs> that was fun. She disappeared into the darkness. What was that? I couldn't forget about her. I shared my experience with others on Twitter. Then, wait, I wasn't the only one? Five? Six? Many people went through something similar. Girls don't get caught in trees every day. This is odd. A week later, there was a big fireworks festival in a nearby town. I got together with the people I met online and started looking for her. There she is! Get her! It was the girl I tried to save! What the... you guys... I'm sorry! I knew it! I told you! She said she only had underwear underneath, but she was fully clothed. This is ridiculous! You could have just taken off the kimono! Yeah, you made us really nervous and excited! Why did you do this? She started explaining everything. I fell in love with this guy five years ago. I started stalking him, but then one day... You look better in a tree. Maraboshi. So I stayed in the tree for days. I was so happy he said that to me. But he never came back. He dumped me. Then this guy found me and... He was so innocent and cute. The way he panicked... I was hooked instantly. I'm a huge fan of innocent boys. So that's why she was doing this. Fully clothed, she wore a kimono and got stuck in a tree on purpose, waiting for some innocent boy to come and help her. She was doing this for fun. I do this every year. I got pretty good at it too. <laughs> but it's dangerous. Why would you do this? What if something bad happens to you? You gotta take better care of yourself. Wait, my parents told me the same exact thing. I made up my mind. This is how I want to live. Life's too short. It might be risky, but this is what I want. She said with a big smile on her face. A few weeks later, at another fireworks festival... Satoshi, that one. Okay, this will make it harder. 
It'd be more fun this way. Thanks. She was at it again, waiting for an innocent boy to pass by. And I decided to watch over her. I really enjoyed watching her do this. She reminded me that it's not too late to start living your life. The girl I found stuck in a tree. She's my hero. Looking for more interesting stories and videos? Then come check out other videos from Mani Mani people here. We'd love to hear your thoughts too. Drop a line in the comments below. See you soon!